how's it going everybody so sorry i missed last week i was just so exhausted from the week before which was mania and everything else i put out a bunch of videos uh, related to that and a, a toy hunt so i was i had a little bit of a burnout i felt like i needed a week off from not just videos but toy hunting in general uh but uh, i am back at it this morning i'm gonna do almost pretty much an all-day toy hunt we'll see what it brings us i have no idea what the stores have to offer i don't know if holothon is still around uh well we i know new gi joe has been getting uh, dropped at like walmart uh there's some new mcfarlands dropping all over the place some new wrestling some new star wars so i'm excited to see what the stores have to offer today but Thank you for the ongoing support. I blew past 2,000 subs, so thank you so much for that. That is awesome. I'm very happy about that. Um, check out a live stream that I did on Man Cave's uh, channel uh, about a week and a half ago or so. We had a great time. Uh, we're going to try to do that uh, a little more often from now on, uh, probably about once a month. So that's going to be fun. But thank you for the ongoing support. Please continue to comment, like, and subscribe if you have not already. And without any further ado, let's hit the road. Oh, Walmart, how I've missed you. Not really. Let's see if there's anything new. Hmm. This is... Oh, a little bumblebee. Kind of similar to the original toys. Still the same old, same old turtles. Oh, let's see what we got here. Cap. We got Thor. Banner. And Iron Man Mark II. Got Spidey. What is it? It's a really old figure. Oh, oh Roman. I'm like, boy, it's funny one. Huh. This figure. That's all they have. They don't have wrestling. Uh, I grab that. Like, Jeff Hardy. Really old. Jeff Hardy. Let me see. Holy cow. I know. We got Trish over here. Jesus. Okay. Uh, cleaned them out. Eh, I don't know if they cleaned them out. I think they just didn't have anything. Yeah, that's a nice two pack right here. Yeah. I've seen that before. It is a nice two-pack. I like the way both of them look. I, I wish they were leads. If they were leads, I'd be all over that. All right, let's check NECA and the movies. Yeah, sort of, but I don't know how well they're selling. So did you see the new uh, Roman figure that's coming out? Um, comes with the new championship belt, the one that Cody has now. Oh, man, that might be a good one. Yeah, I pre-ordered it. Just for the belt. All right, let's check that guy. Uh, coconuts. All right, what do we got here? What's this? Else. Let's check the movies. This is actually a really good movie. Oh, I pi I picked this up. It's the oh, part. part it's two part two. two. Yeah. Maybe we'll watch that tonight. Maybe. Yeah. I didn't care for part one. I heard this one's really good though, because this is where like everything kind of picks up. Hmm. Let me 
is this? This is a, a really cool special edition. Wow. I haven't watched this movie yet. I keep meaning to. I have it. This movie was absolute poo poo. Dog poo poo to make it uh, more obvious. <laughs> Boogeyman for $10. It's a decent movie. Decent horror movie. Chucky collection. Da, 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 da. All right, what do we got here? Some newer ones. Thanksgiving and Prey, both good movies. Oh, Real okay. I think this is the last uh, DVD release they've ever had. That's pay per views. No, nah, there's more coming out. I think there's at least one or two more coming out. I don't think so. How much is that? It might be worth picking up just if it's the last one. Eh, I don't care that much. I like the the uh, vintage uh, stuff more. Oh, it's like all the animated. Well, that's pretty freaking cool, though. Yeah, still, it's 18 films yeah. in there. Yeah, it's all the animated movies. There's a five film collection. Yeah. Oh, this is all the uh, super Superman. originals. For 10 bucks. I mean, I have it, so I don't need it. This? But, yeah. I mean, not that specific one, but I have all the movies. This would be good for you. Yeah. Yeah, it's all on Max. Yeah, but it won't be forever. Avatar, 3D, Deadpool. Talk to me. I feel like I need to get this movie. Oh. 4K. I don't know. John Wick. Are these 4Ks or what is this? Let's see. I have Blu ray and digital. That's this one. I saw them also. Just Blu ray. I had this on digital, but I need physical. Gotta think about it. All right, let's get going. All right, so here's Target, and this Target doesn't have anything. Yeah. What's this? Oh, they got this. Oh, this is on sale. Let's see. Which this is on sale for. 25 bucks. Uh, it's still not worth it to me. Alright, the next wave of this needs to come out already. <laughs> the next wave is actually coming out within a day or two. Yeah, that's why these are on clearance. Oh, they're on clearance? How much is it? 16. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. 40th. The Ram Man. Uh, oh, they got the 40th uh, sticker. 
fresh. Much new for Transformers. Oh, this is new. Cassandra Cain. Okay. And not much else over here. Let's see if they have anything left for Holothon and uh, I'll check NECA too. Check Lego. Hmm. This is cool. This is a uh, Grogu's escape. So now we're at uh, Ollie's to see if they got anything new here. It's pretty well stocked. Um, got, well, they got a lot of him. They got a lot of Black Panther figures. There's Namor, which is actually a pretty nice figure. They got this one. Black Panther figures. <laughs> the Eternals. I mean, even at $7.99, nobody's taking these. It's pretty wild. And there's a uh, Winter Soldier. A ton of the uh, starting lineups. Those are all starting lineups. Look at all those Joel and Beads. Look at all these boxes. Yeah, Joel and Bead. Uh, Luca, John Moran, Trey Young. <laughs> Boy, they can't give these away. Nobody wants them. Dude, these were 50 bucks when they first came out. And you know, look at them now. Oh, yeah, I mean, they're not that cool. <laughs> no, they're not. Yeah. So, this. All more Black Panther stuff. Still just those two, Hogan and Flair. Hmm. Okay. Let's put it on tonight. <laughs> so they got the uh, Legend Series Black Panther helmet. It's kind of cool. It's 30 bucks. I'd get it for you. I'm not getting that. What am I going to do with it? Wear it at your party? Yeah. All right, let's go. So we're at another Target, and the wrestling Star Wars section didn't have anything, but this section has a few things. So first off, it has the 86 series for Blaster, which is pretty cool looking. And also, they have the uh, Platinum Edition for Steel. I kind of like the normal one better, so I don't know if I'm going to pick this up. I already have the other one, but it's kind of cool to see. Over here, <laughs> nothing. Okay. All right, let's check NECA. Right, here's their NECA section. It's pretty messy. Platinum Edition and Scarecrow. Kind of randomly sitting here. Oh, so these are on sale. Wow, 
649. Not bad for 649. Yeah, they got both of them. Kirk and Spock. So we are stopping at Vortex. They got some cool stuff here. So I think I'm gonna get this. I've been actually trying to find this figure for a long time. I'm definitely pay, picking this up. Awesome. That's what she wanted to play anyway, isn't she? Yeah. What are you grabbing in here? Oh, do you see these look clean? They have black belt? Uh, yeah. yeah, I'm grabbing this John McClane. Yeah. I've been actually looking for this figure. We just got some uh, 70, but it's actually a really good price for it. Really? Yeah. Which ones? Revenge of Shinobi. Oh, Revenge of Shinobi's great. Is it? Yeah. And boxing. That one's not that good. No. Yeah, but Shinobi's awesome. I've oh, got some wrestling. Some heavy hitters here. It's very nice, very nice. Donnie Darko. And some heavy hitters for video games here. Token chair too. Mighty final fight. Now, yeah, now, now, yeah, we'll jinx it, buddy. Yep. Alright, so we are at another target. And what do we got here? They do later in the day, or what happens? Okay, Eel Sky, she's kind of a hard figure to find. When that mutant mayhem goes on sale. Depending on how much it goes on sale, I kind of want it. <laughs> oh, look at this. Look at this. This is actually the only one I'm missing from the series, but it's the one by far I like the least. Look at this. Oh, this target actually has quite a bit. 
and they got this, which is like impossible to find. This is going for quite a bit on eBay, last time I checked. I picked it up a few weeks ago, so I'll, I'll leave that. Hmm. Interesting, very interesting. So, uh, this Target had some stuff, just not the wrestling. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, Lego. Let's check, uh, actually, let's check Lego. Let's see if there's anything. Huh. I know this is new. I've never seen this before. That is awesome. that one again. I love that pot race. <laughs> it literally takes so much energy for me not to get into this Lego Star Wars, but can't do it. Can't do it. But I do really enjoy looking at it. Okay. Got tons of stuff here. This is a great firestorm. It's also not a bad thing here. No heads. Oh, look what's sitting over here. Ken. I still have not seen um, M. Bison though. I definitely want to grab M. Bison if I see it. They're cleaner, high quality, hard working products. Here's what I got I got a body wash for you. I've got a very cool shampoo and conditioner. All right, so here we are at another Walmart, starting out Transformers, as always. Oh, Sunstreaker. Invader, but 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 look at that. Look at what we have here. That is nice. I was thinking some other stuff too, but I'll get to it. It's a nice two pack actually. Kevin Owens, AJ Styles. Move on down, shall we? Rhonda. Oh, they got the oh, they got the new bread. Nice. All right, what else they got? Oh, they got the new Piper. Actually, they got Piper and bread. Very nice. I'm gonna kind of take a picture of that. You know, thumbnails. Hashtag. <laughs> and look what else they got down here. Supreme. 
That's a cool freaking figure. Not gonna lie. Let's see what else I got. See the only Supreme. That's what it looks like. Oh. Yeah, so he's the only one. Not interested in him. I honestly don't even know who he is. I don't really watch AW watch at this point. AW has been garbage. I just can't. <sighs> All right. So not bad, not bad at all. Let's go check out NECA. All right, so here we got NECA. <clears throat> and it doesn't look like anything really too new. A foot Soldier 2-packs. Yeah, nothing much. I'm actually going to grab this... Uh, movie on DVD. I just I looked up the uh, reviews on it. It's actually not bad. Uh, I like a uh, fun uh, kind of holiday horror movie. So I'm going to grab this. It was like, I think it's like 10 bucks. So yeah. <laughs> so this is another target, but here's the wrestling section. But when you look closer, check this out. Hulk Hogan 22, Yokozuna Ultimate, Muhammad Ali. So they are getting ready for this new wave. It's supposed to be dropping today. So what I'm going to do, Brian Daniels in AEW, uh, I'm going to go ask. And I'll see if uh, they have it in the meantime. Let's see. I've not seen this yet. And I, and I don't get this crossover like what Stranger Things have to do with Monster or Masters of the Universe. However, that is a very nice Skeletor. Like, no joke. I guess that's kind of cool looking for, uh, like, Motu inspired Devon Gorgon, but it's not exactly a natural crossover, let's put it that way. some new G.I. Joe stuff for you guys. I'm not into it, but for you guys that are, there's some new stuff dropping. Alright, let's go check NECA, and then I'm going to track down an employee and get to the bottom of this uh, WWE figures. Stay tuned. Over to the main NECA section. What do we got here? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. The samurai one. And what? This came out like probably about four or five years ago. So it's being re released, which is good. It was hard to find back then. What's this Predator? Ultimate Warrior Predator. Yeah, kind of looks like a standard Predator, honestly. There's all the various turtles. So I might have to get this. Let's see what 
else they got in here? traditional Aquaman. Batman. What are these? What? What? Interesting. Alice Cooper. Is it all Alice Cooper? Yeah. I'm not a big Alice Cooper fan, so I don't care, but cool. This line gets a lot of flack, but I liked it. All right, um, let's see. All right, let's see. All right, so they were able to locate uh, Yokozuna, which is awesome. I have this pre-ordered. It actually should be arriving today, but they did not have the chase. So, oh well. But they're actually ch checking for me on the um, Hulk Hogan. Because he has a chase, apparently, and I'm not sure what the chase is, but they're going to bring out all of them, I think. So we'll see what they bring out. Just, they did bring out the Hogan for me. Uh, there's no chase here, but it's a cool, it's a cool Hogan figure. I like that. It's kind of different. Okay. He, he's going to be arriving at my house today, so I'm not going to grab him, but uh, that's cool. All right. Next. So we got another target, and this one's got these. Any other chases? Snarl before, which is pretty cool. Alright, here's your neck section. That's cool. We got another Walmart, and these are popping up, looks like everywhere, which is pretty cool. Otherwise, not much else here. They got uh, the Penta L0, which I really don't have interest in. Decent amount of Star Wars, nothing I need. Of course, of course there's tons of Landos. I do have this flash, which is a nice kind of classic flash. Hmm. 
I'm not gonna grab. I'm not gonna grab them today, but maybe at some point in the future. Not much else now. Yeah, so last Walmart of the day. And I actually did find something here. There's people over there right now, so I'm, I won't go over there, but I'll show you what I found. Got a few of these Master Burrs, and this is <laughs> it's unbelievable. Trap drop. Like, I, it's, it's stunning, really. This might be one of the best eight trap draw figures since the uh, classics. They also had a man at arms, which uh, wasn't bad. I'll uh, see if I can get over there. Turtles, turtles. Lots of Iron Man and Spider Man. Getting this line, but that's cool. So here's the uh, man at arms. They just had they only had man at arms and uh, <sighs> trap jaw. Wait, what's this? Oh, it's just Sodak. Okay. And the one of Supremes. Anything over here of significance? Not really. Some Vaders. It's cool that they released a Vader for people that don't have them. Oh, that girl. Let's see. Nope. These are definitely dropping. Duke, this is a nice one. This is Page Puncher, uh, Superman, Nightwing. <clears throat> Batman, let's see, they got some stuff up top. Oh, here's the Flash. And that uh, looks like another Flash. So, they got some, they got some decent stuff hidden here. So, very good toy hunt today. All right, let's head back and show you what I got. All right, guys, so I am finally home, and this ended up being a really great toy hunt. Lots of new stuff. Uh, missing one week was actually pretty invigorating because last week, from what it looked like, there was nothing new. And there's nothing more frustrating than going out to do toy hunt, and there's nothing. So it seemed like I took the right week to take off. And this week, my goodness, uh, while it started out a little slow in the beginning, boy, did it pick up, especially on Sunday. I did it over the course of two days, and on Sunday especially, everything seemed to be dropping all over the place. So that was fantastic. So without any further ado, let me just get into all the pickups. Uh, please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Let me know if you guys have been finding anything new. And uh, let's see, I will start out with this. I got this actually a couple of days ago, and I was really looking forward to this game, and it's actually pretty good. Um, it is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Arcade Wrath of the Mutants. And what this is, is this is the uh, port of the arcade game that came out maybe like five, six years ago. It's based on the Nickelodeon cartoon. And it's actually a really fun game. It's basically a Ninja Turtles arcade uh, brawler, just uh, with the uh, new uh, Nickelodeon style graphics. And I'm really enjoying this game. I think it's a lot of fun. So I got that. I uh, got these from Ringside Collectible. Uh, first one, it's uh, Series 109 Elites. It's uh, Seth Rollins with that new championship belt, which is the one that uh, Damian Priest has now. And these pickups are pretty much from the last two weeks since I didn't do a hunt, uh, an official one last week. Some, so some of this is stuff is stuff that came in the mail over the last two weeks. Next is Elite 109 Cody in the suit. And 
Next is uh, Jailbird Dom, which actually looks really good. I like it. And this one is a really nice uh, figure as well. It's kind of a modern uh, stylized uh, Shinsuke Nakamura with soft goods. I think it looks really good. So got those. These next two figures I picked up at GameStop, but I didn't actually get footage of it. Uh, so this one is uh, from McFarland Superpowers, Sinestro. I think this looks really nice. And I'm really enjoying this line. I just am. I know a lot of people give it flack, but I don't know. I, I, I'm digging it. Uh, Superman, the gold one. So that's pretty cool. And let's see. Uh, this came in the mail. Um, as I've stated many times before, I'm don't really collect a lot of Marvel Legends, but I do like picking up like key characters, um, something from the X-Men, from the Avengers, uh, things like that. And I needed him. I, I wanted this one to go into my uh, Sentinel display. I'm going to add him and it is uh, Angel. My dog, of course, has to be going crazy. Maybe it's uh, some packages being delivered. Um, I am waiting for the Target uh, figures to be delivered, the ones that we saw in the store. I obviously didn't pick them up in the stores because they've already been shipped out and it's supposed to be delivered today. So probably going to show them in next week's pickups. This is a from Collect Forever. Uh, it, it is a 1 in 1000 Jazzwares limited edition uh, CM Punk AEW figure. This is probably his last... Not probably, I'm sure it is his last AEW figure. But it came in this really nice protective case. So this is really cool. So got the CM Punk. And similar, I also got the 1 in 1000 Sting. So these look really nice. Really happy to get these. I don't get a lot of AEW figures at this point, but I kind of, again, similar to Marvel Legends, I just want to get, uh, kind of get the highlights, get the main guys, but not uh, dive too deep. Uh, from the Uncensored collection, uh, I believe, this, yeah, it's Epic Toys, uh, came Sabu. This is awesome. Loved Sabu back in the ECW days. So that arrived. Uh, let's see, this, uh, you guys saw me pick up at Vortex. I am so happy that I got this. I've been actively looking for this figure for a long time, for if we're talking multiple years, and I never see it at cons. Um, every time I look on eBay, it's like like a hundred something dollars, and I can I just never can bring myself to uh, pay the eBay prices. But just lo and behold, <laughs> Vortex had it had it, and I could not be happier. It is the NECA Cult Classic Series 3 John McClane. I love this figure. I'm so happy. It's not a perfect figure, but I've been wanting it for a long time. There's not a lot of John McClane figures, so uh, very happy to get that. Also at Vortex, uh, this was a huge get. Another a piece that I've been trying to get for a long time. It's actually pretty expensive, and they had it on the low end as to how much you would find it for. It is the Mesco Deadpool. I have the Mesco Wolverine, so I want to set them up together. I think they're going to look incredible together. So many options on this guy. Can't wait to uh, take them out and start kind of playing with them. So, finally, finally, finally got the Mesco uh, Deadpool. It's going to look great with the Wolverine. Very happy about that. Next, I got, uh, you guys saw me pick this up at Target. It is the Ultimate Jigsaw from Saw. Very nice figure. I'm going to add it to my horror um, shelf. Uh, next, also from Target, is the Target exclusive pay-per-view limited edition Daniel Bryan, or Brian Danielson. I keep calling him Daniel Bryan. But Brian Danielson is actually his real name. So that is very cool. Very happy to get that. 
And last but not least, I uh, picked up Trapjaw from Masterverse. And lo and behold, came home and looked. I already had this figure. So what are we going to do with this extra figure? I am going to end up donating it to uh, Man Cave where we are doing our uh, next stream, I think next month, we're doing the trivia and we're going to need prizes. So I'm going to uh, donate this to the pool of prizes for our trivia stream. So that's what I'm going to do with this. So that is it, guys. Uh, I think this week was a banger. This is one of the uh, best toy hunts I've had this year. I'm uh, really excited about it. If every toy hunt could be this fun, it'd be awesome. A lot of the times, it's just, you know, looking at the same old, same old. But uh, this week, a lot of new stuff hit, which was really cool. So I'm very excited. Uh, again, please be sure to let me know what you guys have been finding and what you guys have been picking up. Uh, next week, I'm actually going to, uh, it's called uh, 80s uh, Wrestling Con in New Jersey. And going to uh, pick up uh, some autographs there. It's also going to be a con for, you know, going to be a lot of wrestling vendors. So that's going to be pretty cool. Um, so that's going to be primarily the hunt for next week, but I will hit up some targets and Walmarts as well. So that'll be all part of the same hunt next week. So anyways, guys, thank you for the ongoing support. Please be sure to comment, like, subscribe. Until next time, take care.